Look who decided to stop by. Our friendly neighbors, Trudy and Oliver. Oh! Kevin and I are having a very serious conversation now, and I look over, and he's got a pencil sticking through his beard. <laughs> did you even remember you had that? Yeah, I just did. <laughs> so, a couple days ago, when we had that really windy day, and our greenhouse got destroyed, Kevin and I moved Olaf and Odin's little structure over so that it wouldn't get blown away in the wind. Are you banging on the fence? Uh, and we moved it, and now... Uh, they're really mad about it, I think. They've been very, like, whining a lot lately, and they sleep in the same spot that the structure used to be, and they won't go in it since we've moved it. So we're gonna move it back now. I think they just grew accustomed to that spot or something. They really liked it, right, guys? We'll fix it, I'm sorry. We threw you off, I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little pink nose. I'll fix it. I'll fix it. First, we'll give them a little dinner. Ready when you are, Charlie. Marco got his head stuck again. Are you gonna do it or do you want me to? <laughs> huh? I don't know why he keeps sticking his head through there. There you go. Hey, hold on. Hold on. We are headed to a Christmas parade because little Emmett and his Boy Scout troop, they are gonna be on one of the floats. I just talked to my mom on the phone and she said they are also going to a Christmas parade in Sarasota. So let's go see some twinkly lights. We are in line at Coffee on Main. Uh, we're going to the Parade of Lights tonight. Check out this little line. This is a small town line right here. <laughs> Look at how lovely this is though. We're gonna watch the parade go by right here. We're gonna run and chase Emmett's float. <laughs> right now I'm totally warmed up so we just called Kelly and I think Emmett's almost here all right here's Kelly's float there they are Look at the most handsome you know I mean? boy in the whole world. Do you know what I mean by His that? His name's though? Wally. You guys know Wally. I was thinking about doing one like, I don't know. I think what, I think that was. You're supposed to trade me. <gasps> Karen! Oh. Our fate, you just sealed our fate. Wow. That was supposed, oh okay, cool. Here, here. No, too late. You, yours is probably bad luck. 
You guys, I'm so excited because we're watching Star Wars. We're gonna have a Star Wars marathon, watch all the Star Wars movies before the new one comes out. Unfortunately, the new one is sold out in every movie theater in our area on the opening night. So we won't be going opening night, but I talked to my mom on the phone this morning and she had a whole schedule planned out for when they come for the holidays and she already scheduled out a day where the whole family will be seeing Star Wars. So it's happening. We're starting right now. Great news guys, Kelly enjoyed Star Wars, A New Hope, episode four. She usually does not like any movies made before 2000, so great success. And we'll probably watch the next one tomorrow. And one of you recommended to me in the comments that I watch SNL today because Ryan Gosling was hosting it and I did watch it, it was really funny. Thank you for recommending that to me. And it made me remember that when I was a kid, like probably too young to be watching SNL, I asked my parents if I could please watch, and they said no, it was too inappropriate. But my friend Carly, who was a year older than me, was allowed to watch it, and I told them that I wasn't gonna eat until they let me watch SNL, <laughs> because I was a very dramatic kid, I guess. Uh, and I cracked and I ate, and I couldn't, I couldn't keep up my protests. Uh, but once I was old enough to watch, I was very happy, and I do love Saturday Night Live. Okay, I'm going to sleep. Tomorrow I think we have some more fun winter festivities, holiday festivities, I'm not sure. Kelly has it all planned out. But for now I'm going to sleep because it's nice and cozy in here and I'm tired. I hope you guys have an awesome morning, afternoon, night, wherever you are in the whole entire world and we will see you tomorrow.